Have you ever wondered how your finances measure up to the average American? It's a common curiosity, especially in today's economic climate. It's a question many of us ponder, especially when we hear alarming statistics about debt and savings. These numbers can be quite daunting and often leave us feeling uncertain. The truth is, the financial landscape in America is a mixed bag. There are vast differences in how people manage their money, influenced by various factors like location, income, and lifestyle. While some are thriving, many are struggling to make ends meet. The gap between financial stability and instability can be wide and challenging to bridge. Let's dive into some eye-opening financial statistics that reveal the state of the average person's finances. These figures can provide a clearer picture of where we stand. Understanding these figures is crucial for gaining perspective on our own financial situations. It helps us see the bigger picture and recognize common financial challenges. It allows us to benchmark our progress and identify areas where we can improve. Setting realistic goals becomes easier when we know where we stand. Remember, knowledge is power, and in the realm of personal finance, it can empower us to make smarter decisions and build a brighter financial future. With the right information, we can take actionable steps towards financial security. This isn't about comparing yourself to your neighbor or feeling inadequate. It's about understanding your own financial health and making informed choices. It's about arming yourself with the information you need to take control of your money. Knowledge equips us to handle our finances more effectively. So, let's take a closer look at these statistics and see how we can use them to our advantage. By understanding these numbers, we can pave the way for a more secure financial future. The median household income in the United States is a significant indicator of the financial well-being of its citizens. As of 2023, the median household income stands at around $70,784 per year. This means that half of American households earn more than this amount, while the other half earn less. While this figure provides a general understanding of income levels, it's essential to consider that it represents an average across various demographics and regions. Factors like education, occupation, and geographic location can significantly influence individual earnings. Remember, income is just one piece of the financial puzzle. How we manage and utilize our income ultimately determines our financial health. Retirement might seem far off, but it's never too early to start planning. Unfortunately, many Americans are lagging behind when it comes to saving for their golden years. The median retirement savings for Americans is a paltry sum, especially considering the rising costs of living. Experts estimate that most individuals will need significantly more than the average savings to maintain their standard of living in retirement. This discrepancy highlights the importance of starting early, saving consistently, and investing wisely. Don't let these statistics discourage you. Instead, use them as motivation to prioritize your retirement savings. Remember, even small contributions can accumulate significantly over time, especially when coupled with the power of compound interest. Social Security often enters the conversation about retirement, but it's crucial to understand that it was never intended to be a sole source of income. The average Social Security benefit is modest and may not be sufficient to cover all living expenses. Relying solely on Social Security during retirement can put a strain on your finances. It's essential to explore other avenues for retirement income, such as employer-sponsored retirement plans, individual retirement accounts, and other investments. Don't wait until retirement to realize you're falling short. Take proactive steps to build a solid retirement plan that incorporates various income streams and ensures a comfortable and financially secure future. Where does all the money go? Understanding where our money goes is crucial for gaining control of our finances. The average American household spends a significant portion of its income on essential expenses such as housing, transportation, food, and health care. However, discretionary spending such as entertainment, dining out, and travel can quickly eat into our budgets if not managed carefully. Tracking expenses and identifying areas where we can cut back can free up more money for savings and debt reduction. Creating a budget isn't about restricting your lifestyle. It's about making conscious choices about your spending and aligning it with your financial goals. By understanding our spending patterns, we can make adjustments that lead to a healthier financial life. Credit scores, a measure of financial health. Credit scores play a vital role in our financial lives, influencing our ability to secure loans, rent apartments, and even land jobs. They are often the first thing lenders and landlords look at when assessing our financial reliability. The average FICO credit score in the United States is a numerical representation of our creditworthiness. 
based on our credit history, payment history, and debt levels. This score can range from 300 to 850, with higher scores indicating better creditworthiness. A higher credit score typically translates into more favorable interest rates on loans and credit cards, saving us money in the long run. It can also mean better terms and conditions on financial products, making it easier to manage our finances. Maintaining a good credit score requires responsible credit card use, timely bill payments, and monitoring our credit reports regularly. It's important to check for any errors or discrepancies that could negatively impact our score. Think of your credit score as a financial report card. Just as good grades reflect your academic performance, a high credit score reflects your financial responsibility. Just like you wouldn't want a poor grade on your academic record, you don't want a low credit score affecting your financial well-being. A low score can limit your financial opportunities and increase the cost of borrowing. Drowning in Credit Card Debt Credit cards can be convenient tools for managing expenses, but they can also lead to a slippery slope of debt if not used responsibly. The average American household carries a significant amount of credit card debt, which can accumulate quickly due to high interest rates and compounding. Carrying a large credit card balance can strain our finances, limit our ability to save, and impact our credit scores. It's crucial to prioritize paying down credit card debt as quickly as possible to avoid falling into a cycle of debt. Remember, credit card debt is not free money. It's a loan that needs to be repaid with interest. Breaking free from credit card debt requires discipline, a solid plan, and a commitment to living within our means. Net worth. A snapshot of your financial worth. Net worth provides a comprehensive picture of our financial standing at a specific point in time. It represents the difference between our assets, such as savings, investments, and property, and our liabilities, such as loans and credit card debt. The median net worth of American households varies significantly by age group, reflecting the accumulation of assets and repayment of debts over time. Building a healthy net worth requires a multifaceted approach that includes saving, investing, managing debt, and planning for the future. Remember, building wealth is a marathon, not a sprint. It requires patience, discipline, and a long-term perspective. By making smart financial decisions today, we can secure a brighter financial future for ourselves and our loved ones. Savings Rates – Living Paycheck to Paycheck The savings rate, which reflects the portion of income that households save, is a crucial indicator of financial health. Unfortunately, the average savings rate in the United States is relatively low, suggesting that many Americans are living paycheck to paycheck. Having a healthy savings cushion provides a financial buffer for unexpected expenses, emergencies, and future goals. Increasing our savings rate, even gradually, can significantly impact our financial well-being and provide peace of mind. Saving money is not about depriving ourselves, it's about prioritizing our future financial security by automating our savings, cutting unnecessary expenses, and finding creative ways to boost our income, we can increase our savings rate and build a more secure financial foundation. Financial freedom, a journey, not a destination. Achieving financial freedom is a journey that requires knowledge, discipline, and a willingness to make informed decisions. It's about continuously educating ourselves, staying updated with financial trends, and being proactive in managing our finances. Understanding the financial statistics of the average American provides a valuable benchmark for assessing our own financial situations. It helps us see where we stand in comparison to others and identify potential areas for growth. By comparing our income, savings, debt, and net worth to national averages, we can identify areas where we excel and areas that require improvement. This comparison can serve as a motivational tool to strive for better financial health. Remember, financial freedom is not a one-size-fits-all concept, it's about defining what matters most to us and aligning our financial goals with our values. It's about setting personalized goals that reflect our unique aspirations and dreams. It's about having the financial resources to pursue our passions, support our families, and live life on our own terms. Financial freedom allows us to enjoy the little moments and create lasting memories without the constant worry of financial constraints. It's about breaking free from the shackles of debt, building a secure future, and experiencing the peace of mind that comes with financial security. It's a continuous journey of growth, learning, and achieving milestones that bring us closer to our ideal life. The Power of Small Changes Improving our financial well-being doesn't require drastic overnight transformations. In fact, small, consistent changes can have a significant impact over time. 
Start by setting realistic financial goals such as creating a budget, reducing debt, or increasing savings. Seek out resources and support from financial advisors, online tools, and educational materials. Remember, every step we take towards financial literacy and responsible money management brings us closer to achieving our financial aspirations. Don't underestimate the power of small changes. Just like a single seed can grow into a mighty tree, consistent effort in managing our finances can lead to lasting financial security and a brighter future.